Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Dyra. So as you can tell from the title of this video, I have officially jumped on the bandwagon for headband wigs. <laughs> If you watch my channel, you'll know, and I've said it several times, I am very lazy when it comes to doing my own hair. Um, I have a bunch of daughters and I do hair for a living, so when it comes to doing my hair, I really don't feel like it. So when Julia Hair offered to send me a headband wig, I was all over it because you know I've had it tried it and in my mind I'm like it's just a wig that you pop on and keep it moving I'm all for it I do wear you part wigs when I want a short style and those are just as easy you just clip them on and keep it moving same thing with clippings so um, I figured why not try the headband wig so the wig that they sent me is a 24 inch Malaysian curly. Let me show you up front what it looks like. Now the curls on this wig match my curls a whole lot, but of course you can see that this hair is black and my hair isn't. And we do have to leave some of my hair out so I was thinking of doing two things. I, I was thinking of either trying to take about an inch or so off of the front part of, of this wig and see if I can color it my color so it can just look like a two-tone um, kind of situation, but um, I haven't tried that yet. So my other option that I'm going to try is to use a black edge control. So that's what we're gonna do today. But I just wanted to show you, this is the box that it comes in. And then they sent me uh, two of these wig caps and also five headbands. So this is a cute little fat, uh, green one. Here's a multi-color pink one, a blue and white striped one, black, and then I have a red and blue bandana um, headband. I've already shampooed and conditioned it. Um, I like when it has that little natural frizz look to it. So yeah, that's the best thing to do. I shampoo, conditioned it, and then I apply a little bit of Influence moisturizer to it. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I have my hair, my own hair back into this little bun thing. So I'm going to put the wig cap on to hold my hair back. All right. So to solve the issue that I'm having that my hair color is different than the wig, I picked this edge tamer. Let's see if it's picking it up. So it's a black edge tamer. So what I'm going to do is just apply some of this to my edges. Not my forehead, my edges. Come on, girl. So I'm going to apply some of this to my edges and slick it back so I'll come back and show you guys what that looks like all right guys so I use the black edge tamer see how it looks it looks good and I didn't even put on that much so that edge tamer is very pigmented all right so and it's kind of okay if a little bit peeps through because in the light I don't know if you guys can see this um, this wig even though it's black it does shine a little bit of brown so it works out all right so let me show you the inside this is what it looks like on the inside it has 
a, a comb in the in the front which is the top of the headband and it also has a comb on the bottom which is the back and then it has a velcro strap like the headband that's attached to it is actually like a, a velcro headband all right so now i'm just gonna throw this puppy on Okay, y'all, so it was a bit of a struggle to get it right, but I think now that I know what it's supposed to feel like, I think next time I'll be able to get it on a little bit better, a little bit easier. Um, I think it will help too if my hair wasn't natural or if I had it braided as opposed to having it in a bun. I think that will work better too. All right, guys, so this is what the hair looks like. Let me move back a little bit. I had to test it, make sure that it was going, it was gonna stay, cause you know you never know when you might have to like dance around a little bit or something. <laughs> All right, so let's put on one of the headbands and see how they look. So I'm gonna try the green one. Looks a little festive. It is Christmas time. I mean, I'm not going to any Christmas parties anytime soon, but yeah, look at that. Oh my gosh, this is really cute. And it's, I forgot what I look like with black hair. So I'm kind of feeling it. I don't know, I'm kind of feeling it. It's comfortable. The hair feels so soft. I think I might have to trim it though. I think I should cut right here and make it even. I don't know. Let's try the other headbands. With the black one, I just feel like mm, it doesn't bring the hair out as much because the band that comes with it is already black, so. It really just covers the seam where the hair starts. Actually, let me show you guys that. This is what it looks like. It's flat up there. I like that it's flat, so it's not very bulky and that makes it look natural. So I do like that. Let's try the pink one. Yeah, I'm feeling myself with this wig. And it's so easy. I'm so lazy when it comes to my hair that I would definitely do this. Oh, the fabric on this, I thought it was like, going to be like the scarf material but it's not it's actually super soft like a stretchable fabric so let's try this one on even though I don't really like the band, whole bandana look I'm just trying it on so you guys can see it but I know I will never wear this one
I look like I'm about to go clean something. <laughs> I guess I could wear this one when I'm about to go clean the house or clean the salon. Oh yeah, she's cute. I love it. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I love it. All right, so I think I'm gonna keep, I'm definitely gonna keep this wig on today. I'm at the salon. I start work in a little bit, in about an hour or so. So yeah, I think I'm gonna keep this one on today. Oh man, I love it. I forgot what I look like with dark hair. I'm feeling myself right now. I love it, guys. I love it. So this is definitely an advantage for us who are on the go. And now that we are home, well, a lot of us are working from home. I mean, obviously I'm not, but I know a lot of my clients are working from home and most of the time they're getting their hair done so they can get on Zoom calls. So they're like pin up my hair because you know I have a Zoom call today and tomorrow and I need it to look cute. Listen, get you a headband wig and pop that sucker on, keep your hair back, braid it back, slick back or whatever. And right before that Zoom call, clip this baby on and then you be cute and feeling yourself how I'm feeling myself right now. Ooh, I love it. I love it. Look at this, y'all. This is making me miss my dark hair. I don't know. I said I was going to go lighter, but I don't know, y'all. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to test the piece and see if it'll go light. If it does, I'm going to take about an inch or so of this and color it my, my um, hair color so that I don't have to do the whole... Um, using the black edge, edge control because let's be honest that defeats the purpose of being able to pop it on even though it didn't take long just to slick my edges and honestly speaking I would do that also even if it was my hair color because you know who wants bush, bushy edges right you don't want bushy edges you want to make sure that it's it's looking cute you can't do half of the job so it probably won't even be that big of a deal but I think I would want it my hair color, so I am gonna try it. But anyway, guys, so yeah, this is my review of it. I love it. You guys should try it. I know that they sell ones that are like body wave. They also sell ones that are straight, but um, I feel like you have to actually curl it or straighten it and do whatever to it. With this one, I feel like I don't have to do anything to it. Like I told you guys, I, I um, washed it and conditioned it so it can have this like frizz look. I applied a moisturizer on it, I hung it up to dry, and it's ready to go. If you get the one with um, that you have to actually curl and do, and do it, excuse me. Of course, that one will still be cute, but you, you know, at nighttime, you will have to make it look cute. So in the morning, you can just pop it on. But listen, I'm all about quick and easy, and this is it for me. So I'm gonna leave um, the description down below uh, so you guys can get it if you want it. I'm not talking it up because, you know, I want you guys to get it. That's not the case at all. I'm not financially getting any money off when you purchase it. I'm feeling it. I'm going to be wearing this a lot because it's just so quick, easy, and simple. The hair is soft. It's natural looking. Let me show you the curls again. Yeah, so if you watch my other videos of my curly hair, you can see that this is like almost my hair to the T. So I'm definitely feeling it, it looks natural. I'm all about extensions looking natural and looking realistic. Um, I don't care if I know that you have extensions or people know that you have extensions, they should always look very natural um, and should blend in well at all times. So this wig is doing it for me. All right, guys, so yeah, that's it. I'll leave the information down below. Thank you so very much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.